Hey everyone, welcome to your workout. We're gonna go ahead and do some standing exercises. So we're gonna focus on the quads and the, the glutes are here, the quads are here. We're gonna focus on the quads and the glutes and then some neck stretches, maybe some back stretches. So to start, we're gonna do our side twisting lunge and with a pulse. and 50 and pulse it out for about 20. Get a good little spine twist. Good. Now let's do the other side. So the left leg is forward. Actually, no, <laughs> the front leg is forward. That feels better. Just did the other leg. Forty nine and fifty. Pulse it out. Good job. Okay. We'll do a little bit of a stretch forward. If you're pushing forward, you're targeting the hamstrings for a stretch. And now we're gonna do some side hops with a little bit of a pulse in between. So you're gonna step, pulse, step, pulse, pulse. Just a couple of beats on each leg. You get to your rhythm. Keep going. And 30. And circle the hips out. Target one side versus the other. And circle the hip out to the other side. And hold. Okay. We're gonna do some leg sliders, tap it out. And slide and tap it out with the balance. And then we're just gonna, we're just gonna do simple sliders. That's my back cracking. Oh, it feels good. And oh, it just wants to go. Just go ahead, let it all out. <laughs> Focusing on the quads. Good, okay. Now we're gonna do a simple back kick. Low. This is mimicking like an Eve's lunge. So you can either take a tiny step or a big step, whatever feels good. You're putting a lot of emphasis on this quad. 
So on the reformer, you have a sliding, sliding back pad that you also use for your legs. And so you're basically mimicking that motion, sliding that leg back. So whatever that takes, and you're putting that weight on that leg. Now let's shift it over. So you're gonna feel that muscle fatigue. Now we're just gonna do little leg circles. You can get lower into it, or you can stand up tall, whatever feels more comfortable for you. And you're just sliding the leg, similar to the leg sliders, we're just drawing little circles. And go in the opposite direction. Try to keep your balance and shift. As I'm shifting, I'm stretching out my lower back. I've been sitting all day at my desk at home. There, I started backwards on those. Now I'm gonna draw the circle forward. Feeling it in your glutes and hips, just targeting those areas. And then you come back up Turn into that stretch like a little mermaid. You can pulse it out. And then target this side. Now we're going to do a standing hip circle. So you're bringing your knee up a little bit higher for these and just getting that rotation and balance. We won't do too many. Loosen up the joints. Now we're gonna go forward. Scoop that leg up. Okay, switch and do the other side. Start with the backwards. Now reverse it, scooping it up. Okay, and now we're gonna do our camel stretch. So you can take your hands back. This is a standing camel stretch like you would do in yoga. And if you wanna take one hand up to target more of one side, you can. Now we're gonna do a standing single leg tap. You're just taking the leg, popping it out to the front. You're just tapping the ground, kind of in a lower stance. switch to the other leg and really we're just getting little tiny movements in our legs stay strong you'll feel these a little bit the next day and as we're gonna we're gonna do some little pulsing squats we're gonna hug a tree to do these From the side view, you're just 
dropping the booty down almost like you're going to sit down. stretch and you can pull the arm underneath like a mermaid and look up to the sky stretch that neck out a couple of deep breaths Deep stretch along the side of the body. And stretch those arms back. Some little pulses. All right, let's knock out our abs and then we are done for the day. See if you can knock out about 300. I always try to do 300, it's my mag magic number. <laughs> you can either do them on the ground or if you have a ball, try them on the ball. to come up higher you know just aim a little bit higher you're gonna target the abs even more And that's about the first 100. Let's go ahead and knock out 200. We're a third of the way done. Keep it up. I know a little bit of math. <laughs> That's 200. Now push the fish hands through the knees. Lift up. Don't give up. That's 50, we got 50 more. Ninety, keep it up. Great job on those. Let's do a couple of like, like little ab stretches if you have the time. Oh, arch onto your ball. 
We're at our 15 minute mark. Stretch it out. Keep stretching after the video if you can. And I've got to go. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day. Bye.